Je m'appelle Nordin Maïdjin, euh, j'habite à Marseille, je vis en France, je suis d'origine algérien. Ben, je me sens bien, je m'entraîne dur, je m'entraîne plusieurs fois par jour. Ben, je, le trouve, euh, je le trouve dur, hein. c'est dur, c'est technique, c'est euh, beaucoup mental. Voilà, je me sens bien, je me sens bien dans cette salle, euh, on est une famille. Je travaille beaucoup, j'ai beaucoup de travail avec les partenaires. Il aime le travail, il est toujours laissant. C'est un très bon homme aussi pour le groupe. Il est très humble et j'aime son attitude. Je suis très bien, je suis très bien, je suis très bien, je suis très bien. Le temps est maintenant, mesdames et messieurs, pour les heavyweights. Et c'est scheduled pour trois, trois minutes de rounds. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, we are scheduled for three three-minute rounds in Glory's heavyweight division. And introducing first, fighting out of the black corner. His debut came all the way back at Glory 29 in Copenhagen. His professional record, 21 wins with six losses, 15 of those wins coming by way of knockout. He stands six feet, five inches tall, 1.95 meters, and he weighed in at fight time at 243.4 pounds, 110.4 kilos. He's here tonight in Dusseldorf, all the way from Istanbul, Turkey. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Jihad, the Ottoman Kepeni. His opponent fights from the white corner and is coming off a unanimous decision win in Rotterdam at Glory 78. As a professional, 27 wins with 14 losses, 12 of those wins coming by way of knockout. Standing six feet, two inches tall, 1.88 meters, he weighed in at 237.4 pounds, 107.6 kilos. He fights tonight and represents Algeria by way of Marseille, France. Ladies and gentlemen, ranked number four in the division, here is Nardine Mahadi. Once, once again, your referee in charge of this bout is Edward Stryker. Yes. Gentlemen. Okay, guys, listen. I'm fighting three rounds of three minutes. You know the rules. You protect yourself the whole time and listen always to my comments, yeah? Touch gloves if you want. Back to your corner. This should be a real cracker. Yep, if it's anything like that last one. That last one was a nominee for fight of the year, December 2019. I can't picture it being any different the way these guys fight in their styles. In the first round of that fight, Please, Mahadine the put ring. Kapenik on the canvas, but then Kapenik came back and won rounds two and three to force that fourth round. So here we go, they're gonna hug at the beginning. Now they're gonna try and beat each other up. Heck yeah. Mehadeen in the white gloves, Kapenik from Turkey in the black. Yeah, I think it's going to be more Kapenik with the power punching where you're going to see more combination work and level changes from Mahadeen. You talked about the new fight camp that Mehadeen has. His trainer told us, Saeed said, listen, he's amazing, but he doesn't want to hurt anybody in sparring. He won't hit Bader back and he won't hit Manhoof back. Well, tonight he gets to hit Kapenik back. Yeah. But he said he's getting better with not being nice and sparring, so we're going to see if that translates to the fighting. Oh, I'm sure you've got fighters in camps that, that feel that way. They don't want to hurt their, their training part. Yeah, of course, of course. You never had that problem, did you? No, I didn't. <laughs> you, you'd blast anyone out of there. You don't if care. If they tell me they're hurt, I'm going right for it. Oh, your legs hurts. Nice. Boom. <laughs> it's a target. Yeah, both, I, both of these fighters love combinations. Mahadeen a little bit more, but Kapenik can exchange with the best. Yeah, Kapenik throws big power punches, and then he sneaks in these little hard low kicks because you don't really expect them from him because of the big power hands. But Mahadeen blocked that one. Ooh. Ooh. Smile from Kapenik. He knows that was a good shot. Oh! He's throwing everything behind those. Man, he says he's got the best gas tank in the heavyweight division. That left hook, or that was a right hand, that caught Mehadeen, and he fires back with the left of his own. All right, it started, it started. Big left from Mehadeen. We it's, wanted it, they're giving it to us. Yep, it's definitely starting. Oh, big front kick. 
Oh, Whoa. he's throwing everything in those hooks. I'm hey, holding my breath. This has been a great fight card from start to finish. Even our two prelim fights, yeah. every bout has been fantastic. Unreal. I think this event, I'm going to go home and rewatch it. Man. Yeah, you need to work on your commentary. Take some notes while you rewatch it. <laughs> no, it's for you to give oh. you advice. <laughs> Thank you. I'll send you a nice whole list. Man, that was wild. Kopenic promised a knockout. It's just they exchange and their hands are a little low and they just swing. This is, I have a feeling these guys are going to have a trilogy, too. Yeah, I mean, they almost have to. It's just too even, Steven. It's these big punch counters, especially when Mahadeen's ripping combos. Kapenic just rips big punches. He's going to target the body. No. Looking for that there uppercut. It is. Yeah, Kapenic's got a really good right uppercut. No oh, big, wild right hand scores. Oh, Mahadeen back, then the sneaky low kick from Kapenic. No! The Frenchman just got One, blitzed. Two, three, what power in that four, Turkish Can hand. he make it up? Five. Is it six, six seven, seven, eight? No. He's not no. going to do it. Ten. It's over. Oh. What a knockout victory for the Ottoman from Turkey, Tiaran Kapinic. The power, he waited. He blocked those combinations. And once he found that moment to let that power go, it was good night. What power from the Turkish fighter. Another fighter who promised a second round knockout delivers in the first. Incredible action between those two heavyweights. Wow. It's not, too, it's not too late, by the way, to text or call your friends and tell them to get in on this action. We've still got three bouts to go, ladies and gentlemen. This is shaping up to be one of the greatest fight cards, action-wise, that we've ever called, Joe. Yeah, and even all the decisions, back and forth, knockdowns, good combination, solid technical kickbox. And there's one thing to be wild, but these guys are picking the shots, kicking well, showing great power. We've got two amazing finishes in the first round. Man, that left hook was just on the button, full power, full rotation, and that's just scary power. Well, Joe, my question to you is, Nordine was ranked fifth in the heavyweight division coming into this. Where do you put Kapinik now? Well, you got to give him some big fights. Like, right away, I think of things like, you know, Antonio Plazabot and how big and how strong he is. It's fantastic. And we want heavyweights with big power, and, you know, Kapenik is showing he's got it. Kapenik improves to 27-5 and five with his 17th knockout. He said, my low kicks will be the difference, Joe, but I think it was the left hook. Yeah, I mean, that punching power, the rotation, it was just on the button. And he, he set it up nice. He saw some good body shots, some uppercuts, but the way he turned that hip over, the way he got his core involved in that shot, you, ain't, you can't get enough from that. Hey, his fellow countryman, Gokan Saki, would have been proud of that oh, left yeah, hook. Heck yeah, that's, yeah, I bet you the whole country of Turkey is proud right now. That was a fantastic first round finish. And man, you gotta think, he came back, it was a four round war. Improved, came back, got the big finish. That's what a good kickboxer and athlete does. And his training partner leading up to this fight, none other than Jamal Ben Sadiq. He said, if I can hang with Jamal in training, yep. Nordine's got no shot. But credit to Mahadeen. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, you watched it as it happened. Our referee, Edward Stryker, waves off this contest with an official time of 2 minutes 52 seconds of that very first round for your winner by knockout, Jihad Kepeni. All right, I'm here with your winner, Jihad Kapenik. What a finish, man. After the first fight, four-round war, then you got a fantastic knockout here today. Tell me how you're feeling, my friend. Hi, guys. Today, I am win. I am very happy. I am waiting. I want more. I want more. With a big win like this, where do you think this puts you into the heavyweight division? What do you want? Next, I don't know. Doesn't matter. 
contender, so. So now you're gonna be in the top five. Anything you think you wanna fight. There's Antonio Plaza, Bob, big names. Are these the fighters you're looking for next? My name is Jihad Kepenek. Always big. Yeah. All right, last question for you. Sorry guys, I don't speak English, sorry. Give me one thing for your fans in Turkey watching. Kazandık, çok şükür. All right, there you go. Your winner, Jihad, the Ottoman Kepenek. Hey, not bad for not speaking English, I'll tell you what. But the message has been sent with that left hook. Beware of Shiad Kapenik.